I'm sorry. I'm really... You said you have to work, right? Work? Uh, I guess... Sorry. I, uh, I gotta go now. I have a, um, a dentist appointment now. Dentist? Yeah. Dentists get angry if you're late, too. Oh, I wanted to stay with you a little longer. I guess they'll have to wait until next time. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Hey, wait. I'm actually dating someone. Oh, this is a mistake. A mistake. It's gotta be a mistake. Ah, oh, you know what? It just hit me. You know how they say every guy has three hot streaks with the ladies in his life? This is your third. When the hell were the other two? When we were kids, you're the most popular with the girls. <laughs> I don't remember that. The second time you were in the zone was when you started dating Catherine. Although, uh, that's over if she finds out about this. <sighs> Crap, man. She's probably gonna kill me. That's what you're all scared about. As long as she doesn't find out, you're safe, right? Just act like it never happened. I'm not like you. I can't just ignore this. Well then, why not switch it up? That way you won't hear any more marriage talk, right? All that stuff about soulmates and eternal love is bullshit. Married life sucks, man. You really want to go through the same shit I have? I'm not like you. I don't want to sleep around. I just want life to stay the same. <sighs> what am I gonna do? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Uh, if you're gonna whine, you shouldn't have done it, dumbass. Well, no shit. I wish I could just live all carefree like you. Don't you realize there's nothing you can do, you schmuck? No matter how good you are to a woman, you never know if she'll stab you in the back. <sighs> well, if you're gonna ditch the new girl, hook me up. She's cute, right? You got a picture of her? Nice. No, I don't have her pick. She's not your type, anyway. Come on, how do you know that? Because she's my type. Oh. <laughs> I am so fucked. Hey, have you heard the rumor about the dream where you're falling? Huh? Who cares? Come on, if you fall and die in the dream, you'll die in real life. My friend's boyfriend almost died. Isn't that scary? Huh? How do you know? Were you able to see his dream? Hey, you all right, man? You don't look so hot. Uh, I guess I didn't really get much sleep last night. Obviously. Anyway, you're way too freaked out over a one-night stand. Hey, you paying attention? Listen, man. saw the girl. Oh, really? I figured one of you guys told her to sit with me. Eh, uh, if this girl was cute, you'd definitely remember. You know, I gotta say, because of you jerks, I never get a chance to date anyone. If I was a ladies man, I wouldn't be here every night with you guys. Anyway, you dig the older chicks, don't you? Yeah, I want a woman who's, you know, mature, stern, has a nice pair of heels. Whoa, man. I like that creepy guy in horror movies who tries too hard to be noticed. Shut up! I'm not like that! What's wrong with, you know, having some adult fun with someone older than I am? Hmm. So, did I hear someone call for me? Oh, hey, Erica! I've got a nice pair of stiletto heels I know how to use. Whoa, Erica. Okay, enough of that. So have you guys heard about the woman's wrath? They say it targets cheating men and kills them, or not. Which is it? Wait, 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 what? What exactly is this woman's wrath? Oh, you don't need to worry about it. You only care about your girl, Vincent. 
Oh, what are you talking about? This guy totally needs to know. Cheating is pathetic. I agree with Toby. Pathetic. Who are you calling pathetic? Shut up and eat your peanuts. My eye! Huh? What? You're cheating. Weren't you talking about marriage? Why don't you say it louder? Seriously, stop yelling about cheating and shit. I think someone on Mars didn't quite hear you. Oh, that's low, Vincent. Lowest of the low. Don't call me that. Now you know. Let's just leave me alone. Well, well, come on, tell me about this girl. Oh, God. Apparently, she's destiny level cute. Cut that shit out. Are you kidding? Finding your soulmate is awesome. I'm totally jealous. You jackasses better not mention this to anyone outside the bar. I am serious. Dude, we know the drill. Say, have you heard? It seems that Boss was a bit of a player back in the day and broke more than his share of hearts. You see how he's wearing those tacky sunglasses indoors? They say he's using those to hide his face. <laughs> yeah, right. Yo, Erica, another round over here. Coming right up! You're in trouble, right? Maybe you should invest in some shades. Ha ha ha, shut up. I'm done fooling around. That thing about men who cheat being cursed? Apparently, it's related to those mysterious deaths. You mean, like how Paul died? Yeah. Word is, this is getting called the woman's wrath. <laughs> Sounds like something Erica would like to have. Hey, Paul's been here a few times, right? Yeah. He was a classmate of ours back in high school. I ran into him just the other day. Seriously? How was he? We just traded greetings, but he looked fine. Maybe I should have paid more attention. Hey, it's not your fault. Hmm? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> You and Catherine have been together a long time, right? What was it like in the beginning? I just want to know for reference. <laughs> it wasn't anything special. It was at the reunion. He was giving her dating advice. Then he ended up falling for her himself, right? He ran to her side in the middle of the night when she was depressed, after all. Hey, stop that! Stand-up guy like that turns out to be a cheater. <laughs> Seriously. Seriously, okay, man. They say men who cheat get cursed. Curse? That's so stupid, I can't even laugh at it. <laughs> the timing's too good. Still, I can't believe you cheated. But if she's that cute a girl, maybe it's a lucky accident, huh? What am I supposed to do? Good luck keeping it a secret. That or beg for her forgiveness. This isn't something forgivable. Your chamber. Don't forget your boxers. Martha? Oh, uh, sorry for staring. <laughs> Please sit. <Please it>. <laughs> Have you ever heard this story before? The, the man, man who climbs, climbs the highest mountain, mountain gets his every wish granted. What's that? 
It said a man climbed that mountain 300 years ago and was given a fortune. It said a man climbed that mountain 700 years ago and was given the world. A man who climbs the mountain now will be given his future to do with as he pleases. Is this a fairy tale or something? These are true stories. The story of Rapunzel is based on this true story. A prince who was able to climb a very tall tower gained his princess. Now, what will you gain? Huh? Will you become the man of legend? about what you said in your text? Yeah, I think saying it over the phone would be the same thing. Okay, so? Well... Catherine? It's okay. I think I should tell you face to face. Huh? Come see me tomorrow, okay? Good night. Catherine started dating you because she just couldn't leave you alone. You're stupid in all the right ways. It tickles her maternal instincts. A dominant, independent personality like hers is usually attracted to minds like yours. Is that the way it is? Men who cheat are cursed. If that rumor is real, what are you gonna do? Nothing, because it's not real. Listen, Archie. You've got to become a better man. I don't know how you're ranking it, but I'm not desperate to climb the social ladder. Men are only acknowledged by their upward mobility. Don't be a tumbleweed. Be like Ivy, always climbing. This customer is a journalist. He seems to be obsessing over a certain legend lately. A legend? I was originally looking into these suspicious deaths that have been happening lately. I'm Justin, by the way. Hmm. Have I met you somewhere before? Think of it. Um, I'm sure I've seen you before. Oh, sorry. We were talking about the legend. Anyway, in my research, I found records indicating that similar cases occurred in hundred-year cycles. Many men died last time as well. It's the truth. Wow. Every hundred years, huh? I found a strange variation on this legend going around, too. Hmm? There's a man who survives it. Survives the dreams? Very, very rarely. There's a man who is cursed but doesn't die. Isn't that interesting? It's said that the survivor is granted one wish. If he wished for eternal youth, he might still be around. <laughs> it's like a magic lamp. Well, if this is what you're coming up with, you have a wish in mind for yourself? Hmm, to live forever? Not too typical? Me? 
I wish for something different. Like what? I may wish to change the past and make someone kill me. Oh, uh, <laughs> I wonder what I'd wish for. Then let me introduce you. And this is Todd, and this is Archie. Are you on your way home from the office? Or not? You're not wearing a suit. Suit? Oh, I don't have that kind of job. That's a shame. You're not one of our customers, then. What do you mean? We make business suits. Haven't you ever heard of Bantam suits? Have you heard the jingle? You'll be the cock of the walk in a Bantam. Oh, you're from Catherine's company. Hey, I think I've heard your voice before. Huh? Have we met? Think of it, but I don't remember anything. Todd's a hard guy to forget. His hair looks like a rooster, doesn't it? That's enough cock a doodle out of you. <laughs> oh, uh... Wow, you're sharp. I like my women like I like my blankets. Replaced by a maid every morning. What on earth are you talking about? Take a leak. Hey, uh, is it true Orlando's divorced? Huh? You didn't know? He got married while he was pretty young. He lost a lot of money in some scam, and his wife left him. He pretends not to mind, but I think it still gets to him sometimes. Even when his wife calls him, he... Huh? huh? What do you mean? Um, well, never mind. We'll, we'll talk about it later. Time? I should be heading home soon. Hey, are you going home? Yeah, I'm feeling a bit tired today. Well, that sucks. Go home and get some sleep then. Anyway, be careful out there. I don't want to find out that you wound up crashed out in front of your place. Yeah, yeah, I'll be fine. You don't have to tell me. All right, see ya. It's just... My mother's been calling me up and asking how we're doing. Oh, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. are put to rest. Oh, damn it. Again? How long is this gonna go on? It's been every night now. in the cafe. 
professional. There's someone in the real world who wants me dead. I heard. You think of anyone who would do that? Yeah, I can. A lot of them. A lot? But this curse is nothing compared to there. They escaped from hell. You're here, Lamb. Why are you doing this? We're climbing up these weird blocks, and the monster from yesterday? What was that? This is your dream. What appears depends on you, doesn't it? Oh, I can't let you carry your memories of your dream back into the real world. If you were to try anything in reality, it'd be troublesome for my game. <laughs> well, now you'll be answering my question. This is the third question. Do you envy actors who are frequently used in sex scenes? <laughs> well, which one? Oh, really? So that's your choice. How interesting. Your abilities are exceptional. You best work hard. It's not like no one has ever survived. Really? Far above this place, on the 8th floor, there's a cathedral. It's said that those who reach that holy pinnacle will have the path of freedom opened unto them. And of course, from this nightmare as well. So if I climb to the very top, I'll be saved? I've said too much. I'll guide you to the next trial. Cathedral, huh? Okay, fine. <laughs> to the spike traps. That was fun to watch. I suppose you're different from the other sheep who stop here and wait for morning, afraid, waiting for destiny to save them. I could put this off, but it'll only make me suffer longer. This is the fourth question. Are all men stupid? <laughs> well, which one? So that's how you think. I'll take that as your honest answer. Hey, did all the other guys in here have the same person drop them in here? This is not the time to be worrying about the other sheep. Not if you want to survive. Listen, I can hear the voice of the one trying to take your life tonight. Again? Come on, man. What is it this time? Seriously, give me a break. Right, I got it. Let's have some fun.
got it. Come closer. Did, did I say something? Catherine. I did? Uh, <laughs> well, uh... It's okay. <laughs> but it's a bit embarrassing. It is? You haven't called me by my name before. <laughs> Have you? Y your name? <laughs> Catherine? <laughs> what is it, Vincent? <laughs> uh, nothing. Are you fucking kidding me? Hey, are you angry with me? Sorry for coming by out of the blue. Wait, so she just crashed here? Well, I'm more surprised than angry. I just... I thought that you'd want to see me, Vincent. I... <laughs> Whoa, hey, hey! <laughs> I couldn't keep myself away from you. <laughs> <sighs> Last night was amazing. It was the first time I've ever done something like that. What? what? Whoa, 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 wait. What did I do? You're gonna make me say it? <laughs> You're so whoa, 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 wait. Okay, time out. Time out. <laughs> You've got ten seconds. Okay, look. Why me? Hmm? <laughs> because I like you. What about you, Vincent? What do you think about me? I, uh... I think you're really cute. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> what else? What else? <laughs> Am I just cute? How do I put this? I'm kind of jealous of you. You seem to live however you want. <laughs> what do you mean? That's normal, isn't it? Vincent, you can live however you want, too. Just so long as you never think of cheating on me. <laughs> cheating? <laughs> uh, listen, Catherine. There's something I gotta tell you. Oh... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 